Hi guys, Eugene here and I will tell you how to create logo banner with after scrolling effect and place it uh, to your Shopify theme. The best part is that you can uh, place the banner anywhere on the page. You have the flexibility to set the size of the logos, choose animation speed, create multiple logo banners. In other words, you will have the freedom to create exactly what you need and place it wherever you want on your website. In the end of the video, I will also tell how to optimize uh, banner for mobile devices. Okay, let's start. I will show everything step by step. Uh, at the beginning, we need to prepare uh, logos. We can use uh, three po uh, popular uh, formats. SVG, PNG and SPEC. SVG is uh, recommended because uh, it um, helps to um, have a crispy logo, uh, which uh, looks great on any device, on high resolution device, on retina screens. You can also use a PNG. It helps to uh, make a transparent background, which is uh, quite important for logos. And you can also use a JPEG, uh, but it uh, works not perfectly for logos because uh, we will not have the possibility to make a transparent background. We will use Web Marquee Scrolling Text app from Shopify App Store. I will add the link to the description to this video. This app is easy to use, offer all-in-one functionality, comes with extended two weeks uh, free trial and has no hidden fees. Uh, the app uh, supports all three file formats, SVG, PNG and JPEG. Inside the app, press Add New Marquee to create your first logo banner. Uh, now we will go to contact section and press add new to upload uh, the logo let's press add image and upload our logos uh, we have the possibility to uh, choose the side of the logo let's change it to 200 pixels if you want you also can add some link to the logo we will uh, left it just blank and press save. I will do the same for us logos and uh, on the right side you can uh, see the preview with our logo. I'm adding other logos. Press save. Great. If uh, the side of the logo uh, is bigger or smaller, you can uh, change the side for each uh, logo. And the last one. Okay, um, now we have um, ready to use uh, logo banner. Um, it was quick and easy. Uh, but uh, let me show you how to change the background color, add some spacing uh, between logos and above them, and other settings. Uh, I want to change space between the content. I will make it bigger, 660 pixels. Uh, I want to... Uh, Add some speed, uh, change uh, direction of movement, uh, change background color to white. I want to add more space about and below the logos, also 60 pixels. I can add the option to pause uh, animation on uh, mouse over. And here is a setting to choose the size for uh, logo banner on mobile devices. Now is the time to add our logo banner to the Shopify theme. Before we do this, uh, let's change uh, marquee name to logo banner and press save. Great, uh, go to installation tab 
If you just install the app, please uh, don't uh, forget to activate the widget. Press this button and you will automatically go to the settings. Make sure that the widget is uh, on and press save button. Ok, let's go back. Uh, then we need to choose uh, our logo banner. We can create uh, multiple uh, banners. And we have three options to install. Uh, top bar, um, we will place the uh, banner above the header. Top bar sticky the same, but with uh, sticky effect uh, during the scrolling of the page. And custom placement, if you want to uh, place the banner uh, anywhere on the page. I will choose uh, custom placement uh, settings. I will uh, copy code. Inside the app is a video tutorial, but I will quickly show you how to do this. Mm, so we copy code of our logo banner and go and press go to installation button. In the settings find add section button, choose apps, fab customer key. And uh, in code input field, uh, copy paste your copied uh, code. Mm, if you want to make a logo banner full size without these spaces, uh, choose apps section and repeat after uh, my settings. OK, now we have full screen uh, logo banner and you have the possibility to move it uh, on the page, for example here. And don't forget to save your settings. Finally, we have the banner on our Shopify theme, ready to edit in the future or you can uh, make more banners like this and place it in other pages, so have uh, freedom to do uh, a lot of things with uh, this app.